ChatGPT recently updated one of their existing feature. This feature is there for a long time using which you can customize how ChatGPT will respond to you. In this video, let me show you what are the changes and how can you make use of it. So currently I'm in ChatGPT console. If I click on my profile picture, I'll get one option that is customize ChatGPT. If I click on it, one dialog box will open and here there are few of the options. First one is how should ChatGPT call you? Here you can just update your name and down the line ChatGPT will address you with that name only. And the second thing is what do you do? Here you can update your profession. So what I've done, I have mentioned that IT professional, cloud competency manager, YouTuber, technology blogger. So these are the areas I normally work on. So that I mentioned here. Now the next and important part is what traits should ChatGPT have? And here you will be able to mention how ChatGPT will respond to you, which type of responses you like. And I'll also show you a few of the options here. But very quickly before that, let me tell you the next option that is anything else ChatGPT should know about you. In this text box, you can mention some additional information about you. Don't share any of the confidential information, but without sharing any confidential information, if you can share any additional details about you, which can help ChatGPT to fine tune its responses, then it will be helpful. So here I already updated some of the text and let me show you how I came up with this text and I use ChatGPT only to generate this text. What I've done, if I click on cancel here and I come back here in this tab, here you can see I mentioned I have been using ChatGPT for long. Now I can see some changes in customized ChatGPT option from my profile menu. Based on my usage of this tool till date, what should I fill in this what trait should ChatGPT have? So the fast text box and I asked for the details. Now, after that, ChatGPT generated these responses. In case you are also using ChatGPT for quite some time, then you can get it generated by ChatGPT itself. Or if you are a new user, then you can understand what are the things you should cover and accordingly you will be able to draft your responses. So this is first thing. But whenever I updated these details to ChatGPT, it was hitting that character limit and it was not accepting all this text. What I've done, then I mentioned it's crossing the allowed character limit, give me a revised version. And then it gave me the revised version. And now after that, I realized these details are very short. It's not up to the mark because these earlier details had several things covered, which is not covered here. So then I asked that what's the actual character limit? And then it searched the internet and came back that, okay, 1500 character is the character limit. One surprising fact is ChatGPT needs to search internet to understand what's the character limit of his own tool. That's one maybe a point of discussion altogether. But here what I've done, I mentioned, then revise below text within 1500 characters without losing crux of it. And then I pasted that earlier text here and then ChatGPT revised that response and gave me this text. Now I copied this text and I used it in this particular option of the fast text box. Similarly, I generated the response for the second text box also. What actually it did earlier, I ingested my LinkedIn profile in ChatGPT and it picked up details from there also I can see and it gave me the text. So this is the way you will be able to use this new feature to fine tune how ChatGPT will respond to you. And if you are already using ChatGPT for some time, then you can use the prompts I shown and you can generate the text by ChatGPT itself. Hopefully this tip will be helpful for you and you will be able to make use of it. While we're discussing about this feature, one small announcement, I'm working on a comprehensive course on generative AI. ChatGPT, Google Gemini, Microsoft Copilot, Claude, everything will be covered extensively in that course. I added one link in the description below. Please fill out the form so that I'll be able to communicate a discount coupon once the course will be launched. Recently, ChatGPT also introduced advanced voice mode. If you want to know everything about it, then check out this video.